Yo guys, I've been getting a lot of DMs, PMs, and the AM and the PM about how to hook up the Xbox 360 Connect as a webcam. So let's do this. First, you need to download the Microsoft Connect SDK. Second, you need to get the plugin for OBS. So let's get let's get it. Let's first I'm gonna go to the internet. You're going to look up Connect Windows SDK or sorry Connect SDK 1.8. You're gonna download it. Once it's downloaded, you're going to go Google this, OBS Connect Plugin. You'll get, you'll get this link if you just put that in, but put Sir Linux, that's the guy who made it. Shout out to that guy, he's a super Connect nerd, thanks bro. Uh, then you're going to click on this, and you're going to go to GitHub. Oh man, GitHub, the coder place, it's so, so crazy, I don't know what to do here. Okay, you go here, you go code, and download the zip. Once you got that, and this... Downloaded, you're good. You're going to run this one first. So let's take a look at it. Uh, here it is. It looks like this. You're going to run that. It takes a while. I have a really garbage computer, guys. You're going to know what I'm talking about in a minute. Okay. Once that's done, you're going to crack this guy open here. This Mike is, the monkey. This is the plugin for the OBS. So once the Connect thing's done, you're going to see this crazy stuff. Whoa. Ah. Really friggin' crazy you're gonna go in there and you're gonna go in there and these folders right here you're gonna grab them and drag them into OBS studio so you go to C program files where your OBS is you're gonna open OBS studio you're gonna open plugins you're gonna open that and you're gonna drag these files in there as you oh, can see done. yeah stir that up bro get it done uh, yeah, connect files, There's, they're, all the files are in there already. Okay, I already dragged them in there. So you're going to drag them in there. At the, All this time, OBS is not going to be on, right? Don't plug in your... Uh, also, you're going to need a Xbox Connect thing, right? That's the first step. Don't plug this in at any portion until uh, all the stuff's installed. Don't run OBS. If OBS is running, shut it down. Then plug in your Xbox Connect and by the way you can't just plug in the Xbox Connect you need this like power con converter thing it's uh, 20 bucks on Amazon or something look for the Connect uh, Microsoft uh, cable or something on Amazon you need that cable you can't just have the default cable right alright so once that's all done you drag the files in you installed these things you're gonna launch OBS and then you're gonna see some new stuff so let's go over to OBS here we are alright it's not here right now but when you go add a new element you're going to see connect source there it is you're gonna click it you're gonna add it what's popping what's good alright the cooker yo cooker Okay, so there, once that's done, you have some uh, stuff in here. You can actually control the connect right here. I can make it go up with this thing. See how it's going up? There we go. Here, I'll get it up to... Uh... This might be really glitchy, guys, because the connect, you should have a minimum 4 gig RAM in your computer. Uh, my computer has 2 gig. It's a pile. And if you want to change it to infrared mode or depth perception mode, watch this. Perception, you can actually do a fake green screen too in here. Total, total darkness, all right? Complete darkness, it's rad. All right, so we'll put that back to color. There it is, there's the window right here. It's, it's probably really choppy right now, guys. That's it. That's how we roll. That's how you do it. Set it up, use your Xbox Connect. You can do it in a total darkness. Use this. Use it to your advantage, people. It's the age of the internet. Bad news. You're going to hate it. All right, we're out. Bye.